case you've ever wondered, there's definitely no age limit on artistic inspiration. Paula Talmud stumbled onto a group of women of a certain age who are showing us just how true that statement can be. This is Blackbird Gallery in the Fisher Theater, and when you walk in, you are immediately engulfed, not only in the colors, but really in a story of resilience and longevity and absolutely relevance. Inside, you'll see Juliet Signius, the first black woman invited to dance with the New York City Ballet. She turned them down and instead joined Alvin Ailey at a time when blacks were told they didn't have the talent or the bodies to be ballerinas. Now 83 years old and living in Ann Arbor, it is her paintbrush that dances across canvas and cloth. The art tells a story and it comes from the soul, it comes from the history, it comes from the heritage. Five artists, all more than 70 years old, showing they are relevant in this space. The name of the show is Women of a Certain Age. And, you know, I kind of grappled with that title. Um, you know, you don't want to call out women's age in any way, but to me it um, exemplifies experience, grace, and beauty. Now, are you age sensitive? Do you mind my knowing? I am very age sensitive. It's a certain age, not the age. <laughs> Carol Mauricio is also showing. Color inspires me, everything inspires me. It is these women of a certain age defining and refining the eye of the beholder. This is soil that I brought back from Brazil. So I uh, combine, and that is in that piece also. So what I have done is combined the charcoal uh, technique with uh, a use of soil. And believe me, there's no books on how to draw with soil. So it's been all experimental and um, I learn as I go. Also showing Can Dance Hunter and Ashawalita and internationally renowned artist Shirley Woodson. Several of her works are in the permanent collection of the Detroit Institute of Arts. This is a rare opportunity to come, see, collect, and marvel at the hands time has touched in order to work perfection. I'm very thrilled. Uh, I love being in a space here that's a, a black owned gallery with uh, women who I relate to and women who are accomplished and women who are acknowledged by their, uh, by their peers and women who have been validated. Yeah, absolutely. So the Blackbird Gallery is conveniently located right behind me at the Fisher Theater, or I should say the Fisher Building, and they are open on theater nights. And if you're in the New Center area, then stop on in. The show runs, Karen and everybody, through May 19th. And honestly, when I walked in, I actually got goosebumps. It was that good. I want to stop by. All right. Thank you, Paula. Dog owner 